what's happening guys today we're going to be looking at the new x222 from micromax uh, this device has just been launched in india some time back and uh, at an mrp of about 2500 rupees you can actually get this device for much cheaper about 2000 rupees this is one of the cheapest touch screen phones you can get in the market and uh, this has been done by micromax it's supposedly a tiny little device and it has a lot of features you can see the basic rundown of specs over here it has a touch screen an audio player video player it also has Bluetooth, a camera, you can expand the memory, it also has a dual SIM slot and an FM radio, so great features. The box is already open, so I won't be needing my knife. Uh, this is the device, the X222. You can see it's a very small and tiny form factor. I'm going to put that aside for the time being. Uh, going further in, you get a micro USB charging as well as data syncing cable. Uh, you get the battery, which is a 900 milliampere hour battery. And uh, you get a bunch of earphones along with a microphone and a push button to send in end calls. You also get the standard Micromax charger with a USB port on one side and the standard Indian pin system on the other side. And you get the documentation. You have a quick start guide and the warranty certificate. So that's basically everything from the box. Let's take a quick look at the device itself. Uh, not much to talk about in this device. You have a 2.4 inch screen. The earpiece is over here as well. I'm just going to quickly get rid of the sticker. So you have the earpiece, a 2.4 inch screen, the send and end calls and a 4-way D-pad which is over here which has a center button. You have a microphone over here, 2.4 inch touch screen. On the back you do have a VGA camera, the loudspeaker is over here, your Micromax logo is over here. You also have the charging data syncing port which is a US micro USB port and you also have the headphone jack at the bottom and nothing else around the device, removing the back cover. You will notice that this device will support a micro SD card. Uh, which goes in here it takes up to 8 gigabyte and uh, you do have two sim card slots both of them are gsm let's see if this has any charge left to power on uh, one of the fastest boot ups in mobile phone history so this is the main screen you get your phone dialer over here very responsive touch screen even though it's a resistive touch screen uh, micromax has managed to make it very responsive you can just click the lock button to lock the device again click the lock Click and hold the lock to unlock the device. You can go into contacts, add new contacts, go into color groups, create color groups as well for both your SIM cards. Go into the full application list. You can see that this is a multimedia application which has your image viewer, video recorder, video player, music, sound recorder, an FM radio. You have your call logs, your camera which will open up the VGA camera. A simple camera, don't expect it to be very impressive coming back you have fun zone which will have your cricket alerts love guru naughty jokes all those kind of things you also have friends chat uh, coming to the other side you have messaging your phone book again file manager and settings you can do pen calibration as well to calibrate the touch sensitivity of the device you have phone settings security settings language input settings all those settings are in the settings menu the standard settings application and then you have Bluetooth settings, you have an organizer which has calendar, tasks, alarm and world clock. And then you have applications like calculator, unit converter and text reader. And then you have connectivity for connecting to WAP and GSM networks. So that's basically uh, the device. Let's see if there's some sound I can play, ringtones or something to make sure that it's loud enough. So the speakerphone doesn't seem that loud, but uh, it's fairly decent, not that great. Of course you have your uh, SIM card information over here, your network, both your networks, SIM1 and SIM2 networks which show over here. You have the battery life over here, your network information is over here, date and time is on the screen. You can also customize the wallpaper and the colors of the display. So there you go guys, at 2000 rupees, this is one of the best touchscreen devices you can get at that price. Uh, nothing comes better than that. It's a nice looking small form factor design and uh, can go well for both ladies and uh, gentlemen. So um, go ahead and get this. A 900 milliampere hour battery should be good enough for uh, a long duration of talk time on this device since it's a small device with a small screen, not too much power consumption. So there you go guys, this is a quick look and quick review of uh, the new Micromax X222 budget touchscreen phone with the dual SIM card slot and FM radio.
For more unboxing videos, reviews, and tutorials, log on to iGan.in. If you have any questions, queries, you can log on to our forums. Subscribe to our YouTube channel, youtube.com slash iGan and youtube.com slash iGan TV. You can also catch us on Facebook, Twitter, and on Google Plus. The links to those are at the end of this video or in the, in the description below. If you have any comments or feedback, leave those in the comment section below. If you like this video, go ahead and give it a thumbs up. Until the next video, guys, take care. I'll see you soon.